Hey, how's it going everyone? Welcome back, Don here. Today I'm gonna to put a uh, wash on the Firebird for the first time in maybe close to three years. It's been more than two. I'm gonna give it a good wash with uh, soap and water. Um, but before I do that, I have got to wash the Corvette. Um, we'll give that one a quickie and then I'll uh, break out the Firebird. <laughs> Here's a setup I use, um, just a bucket with a uh, <laughs> piece of pollen in it. Just a bucket with a uh, sort of a, a grate in the bottom, helps the dirt drop all the way to the bottom, keeps it off of the, uh, the uh, I keep calling it a sponge, but it's really not a sponge. It's, uh, I don't know, some kind of uh, microfiber thing, but I try to keep it clean. Um, and there's the car wash soap I use. This happens to be, Meguiar's I think yeah it really doesn't matter which car wash soap you use um, as long as you do not use dish soap You can see uh, some of the some of the gook that gets on here. 
And the other thing I struggle with on this car is uh, my white letters. These tires are relatively new, and uh, I have a heck of a time keeping those letters white. Um, they'll clean up good, but they just don't stay that way. Um, I'm not sure if it's just... Uh, you know, low quality tire, old tire, uh, maybe a sat in a warehouse, maybe, you know, I don't know. Um, I've used these tires for a long time. I've had this car a long time, and this has got to be the, you know, I don't know, fourth set of tires uh, that I've had on this car. And um, the other tires that I've had, same tires, the same radial TA, um, has not had this same problem with the white letters turning color. Um, this is uh, this is kind of a new thing with this set of tires, so we keep cleaning them. At this point, I'll dry it, get it into the garage, use the lift, clean the wheels because I'm lazy and I don't want to bend over if I don't have to. Uh, it'll save my back. One of the easiest ways I found to clean the white letters was to use Goof Off. Um, sometimes I use a uh, SOS pad, you know, and, and you do the old elbow grease, just trying to be somewhat gentle to not scratch everything up, but um, I'm out of SOS pads as it turns out, but um, this will work. This will uh, get me there. It's, uh, it does good enough. It's not, uh, it doesn't hold though, but I, I don't know if it's the tires or what, but once you get these things clean, they don't want to stay clean very long. You can see the difference already with just these two letters. And it doesn't take a whole lot of scrubbing. Huge difference.
maybe uh maybe one of these days i'll uh put together another video with uh a little bit more detail about the car and uh some of the things i've done to it over the years thanks for checking it out though we'll uh we'll see you next time